too, piggies. Roasted meat! Come taste it! Hear ye, hear ye! The Count Victor of Ar welcomes you all to the yearly fair of St. John. Enjoy goods from our region and beyond at the market. Make deals at our fish auction and try your skills in a free session of a shooting game. Tomorrow's event is the long-awaited cow fair. Get ready to overbid. The Count Victor of Arl wishes you all an excellent St. John's Fair. Have you seen? What? The people here. They're smiling. Ah. Uh, <laughs> it's true. Oh, look up there. The house with the weather vane. That's ours. Oh, right above the market. Yes. The view will be amazing. Brushes and combs from Firenze. Try them. My lady, why not change your hairstyle? Thank you, but I like it like this. Oh, good for you. A woman's hair is her righteous crown. Beautifully said. The hair is nice like that. Well, thank you, sir. Oh, this wine. A present for your father, maybe. He's dead, but he loved this wine. Why, he was a very fine man, then. He was. Thank you. taught me. We kept them in a book at home. Do you want to buy flowers then? Thank you, but we like to pick them in the wild. It's our thing. I understand. Enjoy. Yes. Come. Let's see the rest. Sure. Fresh fish from Corsica. Caught this morning. Every four crates gets your fifth for free. Loops. The finest. Your <laughs> attention, please. Be careful and stay where you are. For here comes danger. Here comes fire. Let's go see our house. It should be right up here. Oh, we can share my room if you want. Don't you want your own? Hmm, I don't know. But that way we could invite each other to our rooms. Yes, I love this place. <laughs> Me too. Oh, they're playing music. Oh, I can't see. Hey, you know what? I'll put you up on my shoulders, all right? Oh, yes, please. Here we go. <laughs> You're feeling all right up there? Yes. I can see everything. They do know. They just feel safe here. You will too. Hey, I'm going to put you down for a bit. <clears throat> Let's pick up the base. Yes. I can't wait to see the house. I wonder how big it is. I just hope they have real beds. 
I hope I can see the market from my room. A king's room, of course. Of course. <laughs> Someone's had a long day. Hey, you're back. So how was it? They've got everything. <laughs> it's true. We'll have to go back all together. Sure. We need some fresh herbs. Look at that. I think we can call it home. Yes. Home. I haven't said that word in a while. I'm glad we came. <sighs> and I think someone needs to take a nap. I'm not tired. <laughs> sure. Let's go see inside. This is our door. Ooh. It looks quiet. And it's less hot here. It's nice. Ready to come inside? Yes, lead the way. We're home, Hugo. Our new home. Let's take a look around. Mm. Yes. All right. We'll do that later. Mother, where's Hugo's room? He's exhausted. Upstairs. The bed is ready. Thanks. Come on, you sleepy beast. You must come with me, Sia. Come where? The island. It'll be healed there too. Healed? Well, that would be nice, I'm sure. It will be. You're thinking too much. Sometimes it's better just to trust your feelings. I'm trying, but I... I get stuck in the logic of it. Substances obey natural law. The macula does too. You don't need logic, Lucas. You just need to be human. Maybe... <sighs> I'm just not very good at being human. You are. This is why you have doubts. Today must have woken it. We had six months of respite after he passed the second threshold. But the balance of his blood is very delicate. Amicia, go with Lucas. Magister Verdun is somewhere in this town. Find him and tell him to come quickly. Right away. Amicia. I know. We'll be careful. It's because of those farmers. I should never... Oh. It's not your fault. How can you be so sure? You can't control what happens in his blood. The macula keeps evolving, pushing the carrier through different thresholds. Will this Magister Vodan really help? The Order has been studying the macula for centuries. If they can't, I don't know who can. Lord, protect him. Why hasn't Vodan shown up already? I think he's just being discreet. The order works like this. Someone must know about him. Let's ask around. Here, a town guard. I'll ask him. Uh, hello? Excuse me. Would you know the whereabouts of Magister Vaudin? Uh, I've heard of a Sir Vaudin, not a Magister. Try the marketplace. There's a couple of florists there. I think they deal with him from time to time. Thank you. Good. That's a start. I should have known. Of course he doesn't go by his order's title publicly. We came by the florist earlier. It's somewhere around this marketplace. Hello again. Oh, it's you. 
Looking for flowers for the little one? Actually, I'm looking for Sovodan. I believe he's one of your clients. He's my husband's client. He's the one who deals in medicinal herbs. Oh. But Morton should be right by the fountain. Just tell him I sent you. He's wearing a brown tunic. Brown tunic. Thank you for your help. Let's hope he tells us. He will. Excuse me, sir. Your wife sent us? Now, what does she want now? I'm busy cleaning this mess. It's not for her. We must find Sir Voda. Him? Well, he doesn't like to be bothered. Just like me. Listen, my brother is very sick. We need him immediately. Oh. All right, all right. I don't know precisely where, but I think he lives close to the arena, down there. Don't tell him I sent you. Don't worry. Thank you. Right, let's not waste time. The arena district. That's a lot of houses. How are we going to find him? There's mischief in the air. I can feel it. Yes. That's why I keep the children. It's a slum. The order's not poor, so what would a magister be doing here? Probably hiding? Probably. <laughs> Amicia, that symbol on the wall. The order? Yes. He's in here. No one gets in. The arena is off limits. Why is that? Because the Count of Provence said so. Get going, please. Listen, I really need to pass. It's all right. Come. We'll go around the arena. <sighs> Now's not the time to argue with soldiers. Let's look around. You're right. Sorry. There's a door up there. Yes. So, ready to break the law? Come on. <clears throat> Is it? The bite, yes. They've locked the arena down. They let them die here. It's starting all over again. Not starting. Spreading. Hugo. We brought it here. Let's find Magister Voda. If he's not dead already. I can't believe they left him to rot here. These people look poor. They must be from the slum outside. How come nobody noticed their disappearance? Maybe nobody cares. Maybe. Here, another symbol. Well, let's get in then. You think the symbols will lead to him? Yes. Look, an opening up there. There must be a way to climb up. This could help. I'll give you a hand. Rodan's here. He's in trouble. He knows the bite. He must be avoiding the sick. Lucas, if all these people here were bitten, it means... <sighs> Maybe not. A sick person could have brought it inside the city. Letting you die like a dog. 
Damn, that's an ugly death. What did I hear? So, any sort of nothing yet. A doctor. No, no, Vodan's pretty good at hiding, I tell you. And the boss will be his. Shit. So is there after Vodan too? They think he's a doctor. Oh, just our luck. Well, if he's here, he didn't make much effort trying to cure these people. Look at that. They're poorer than us. Not a coin. And stop looting and look for this bloody alchemist. Ah, oh, someone will find him. some sort of half cart here but it's not high enough i think they were moving the bodies with it oh, is that cage of that's the right size? Ugh. it's full of bodies oh, don't look at them let's push it it's a massacre we brought it here we condemned them it's still going on in Guyenne. it's already spreading Yes, but they would have seen it coming. It wouldn't have changed a thing. Let's go, quick. There's so many dead already. One step ahead of us. Yes, but none of them looked devoured. Look, I think they were keeping count of the dead. They left a knife. It's stuck. Come on. No. Well, let's keep going. Through there. You don't use blades against people. I did. I had no choice. The blade is silent, quick. It's what we need uh, now. All right. It's up to you. <laughs> look over there. Another symbol. Good, but, Lucas, if these people fell ill, it means some must have been bitten. I've seen no signs of attack. Not yet. Anyway, let's go. Soldiers turn bad. That doesn't sound good. Um, Crows! 
Anybody want some roasted bird? Archer, up there. You just shot a dead body, you idiot! Oh, come on! They moved right when I shot! Stop playing and keep your eyes open. Or you'll be explaining to Arno why we're empty-handed when he arrives. Damn alchemist, we find a musk grave. It's fine. Let's just stay here waiting for death. Expected more soldiers. Where are they? Maybe sick or up to something. We're almost out of here. Find the camp soldiers. That I can do. But this, no. You can't fight a plague like this. to roast it bird. Thank <laughs> you. 
made it. We did. But I'm weary of the thieves, murderers, mercenaries, all the bloody scum that keeps getting in our way. Chaos rules our lives. They're part of it. And you're getting better at handling them. I see it. You were pretty discreet back there. Well, better to let live. And not risk dying myself. You smell that? Dead bodies. What is this place? A hospital. I think they used to live here. No wonder they all fell ill. I can't get used to it. You don't have to. in that tower. He has to be. Has to? Lucas, crossing this mess won't be easy or quick. It's the order. A high magister would just live in a high tower, no? <sighs> Let's just get there. 